Duncan Henderson, the Oscar-nominated producer of Peter Weir's Master and Commander, The Far Side of the World, a longtime DGA National Board member and recipient of the Guild's Frank Capra Achievement Award, has died of pancreatic cancer. He was 72. Henderson was Oscar-nominated in the Best Picture category in 2004 for Master and Commander. The veteran producer, unit production manager and assistant director had served continuously on the DGA National Board since 2005, winning eight consecutive elections. Hollywood and Media Deaths in 2021, A Photo Gallery It is difficult to overstate how much Duncan meant to the DGA and his fellow members, DGA President Leslie Link Aglotter said Thursday. His love for his guild and its members shone brightly through his outstanding leadership and 16 years of service as a board member, as a long-standing member of the Western AD-UPM Council, including a term as council chair, and five-time member of the DGA Negotiations Committee. Additionally, Duncan was proud to give back to the organization that helped usher him into the industry and the guild, serving as a trustee on the DGA Producer Assistant Director's training program since 2004. Our thoughts are with Duncan's wife Michelle, his children Jessica, Ian, Fiona, and Ivy, and his many colleagues and friends. He will be deeply missed. Related story Hollywood and media deaths in 2021, a photo gallery Henderson had a prolific career in film with credits including the DGA Award-nominated Master and Commander and Dead Poets Society, Wolfgang Peterson's The Perfect Storm and Outbreak. Chris Columbus' Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone and Home Alone 2, Joseph Kaczynski's Oblivion, and Malcolm Dealey's Space Jam, A New Legacy. Prior to becoming a UPM, Henderson worked as an assistant director on features ranging from John Cassavetti's Big Trouble to Sylvester Stallone's Rocky IV. As a DGA trainee, Henderson worked on projects including Paul Schrader's American Gigolo and Michael Cimino's Heaven's Gate. A DGA member for over 40 years, Duncan's level of passion, service and commitment was beyond exemplary, and for that we honored him with the Frank Capra Achievement Award in 2020 as a mark of his extraordinary dedication, Glotter said. No matter how massive the film, whether the perfect storm, Home Alone 2 or DGA and Academy Award nominated features Master and Commander, The Far Side of the World Undead Poets Society. Duncan was always available as a leader, a mentor and a friend. He gave the same wise counsel and thoughtful consideration to award-winning directors and the production assistant on her first industry job. When asked about his long-time commitment to the Guild, Henderson said upon receiving the Frank Capra Award that I was like all of the my compatriots in the DGA-Busy. At some point I realized that other members who were just as busy as me were making time to contribute to the guild with their service. I decided to follow their lead and join the AD-UPM Council. It was one of the best decisions I have ever made. It expanded the entire scope of my motion picture career, 